Welcome to Woggle Guides. In this guide, I'll explain how you can set an alarm on your Android phone. Let's get straight into it. I'm on my Android phone and looking at a page view of some of my apps. It's quick to set a new alarm on your Android phone, but it can be tricky to do if you've not tried it before. In this guide, I'll show you how to do that in five simple steps. I know that sounds like a lot, but I promise you we'll be done in less than two minutes. In order to set up an alarm, you need to open the clock app on your Android phone. This is shown on screen, but if you can't see it on your phone, you can quickly find it by using the search bar at the bottom of the page. You can search for it by name. I'll tap on the app once to open it. On the page that loads, you'll see I've already set an alarm to go off every morning. To set a second new alarm, I can do that by tapping the plus symbol at the bottom of the page. An initial pop-up screen then appears that asks you to choose the time you want your alarm to go off. You can do this by tapping and holding the small selection icon currently set at 9am. You can then drag this to the preferred hour for your alarm. Once that's selected, the app will then ask you to choose the minutes time for your alarm. You can leave it on the hour if you wish, but I'm going to choose 40 minutes past the hour. Once you're happy with the alarm time, Tap on the blue OK link in the bottom right of that pop-up. Your alarm is now set. The Google app automatically assumes that your alarm is scheduled to go off at the next occurrence of the time you added and confirms how long it will be until that time. The detailed alarm setup screen is also now displayed where you can tweak and change your alarm to suit you. But if you wish, you can leave the preset options unchanged and your alarm will go off at the specified time. I'll quickly step through the main options I change, just to give you an overview of them. The first option to consider is the days on which you want the alarm to go off. If you only need an alarm for one day, you can ignore this section. But if you need an alarm to repeat on a number of days, you can ask the app to add those days to your alarm. You can do that by simply tapping the days on which you want the alarm to go off. The other option I tend to change is the alarm sound. Tapping into that, you should choose the one that you prefer. I can return to the setup screen just by tapping the arrow in the top left of the app. The clock app can now be closed, confident that the alarm will go off at the time you specified. I hope you found this Woggle guide useful and learned something new. If you have, please like this video or subscribe for free so that you can find out when new guides are available. Thanks for watching and do look after yourself until next time.